see Kim Kardashian open up about her lonely marriage to Kanye West on the Keeping Up With The Kardashians series finale. Now we have a Kim Kardashian crying face after this farewell. Keeping up with the Kardashians said goodbye to its fans tonight on June 10th after 20 seasons on E! The bittersweet series finale showed the Kardashian-Jenner family realizing their next chapters in an emotional send-off. For Kourtney Kardashian and Scott Disick, the exes are ready to move on. Meanwhile Khloe Kardashian hopes to give daughter True Thompson a sibling someday but also is hesitant to tie the knot again. Yet, it was Kim's heartbreaking discussion with Kris Jenner that revealed the Skims founder's next steps. Kim opened about the state of her marriage to Kanye West. I used to go to everyone for all the answers and all the problems. It's draining, Kim admitted. I am, like, an adult. I have a therapist. Let me work on myself and see where I am at. Kim is striving for total happiness a majority of the time in her relationship. I just feel like I've worked so hard in life to achieve everything that I've wanted to. And I've lived up to my expectations and achieved 10 times more than what I thought was humanly possibly, but I don't have a life to share that with, Kim continued. Am I just going to sit here and think, okay my kids fulfill me and I am good? I never thought I was lonely. I just thought that was totally fine, I can just have my kids. The long-distance relationship while Kanye was in Wyoming inevitably took a toll on the mother of four. My husband moves from state to state. I am just on this ride with him and I was okay with that, Kim opened up. And then after turning 40 this year, I realized like no. I don't want a husband that lives in a completely different state. Kim admitted that she got along best with Kanye while they were apart, dot, but that's not what she wants out of a partner. I want someone that we have the same shows in common. I want someone that wants to work out with me, Kim gives examples. It's the little things is what I don't have. I have all the big things. I have the extravagant everything you could possibly imagine and no one will ever do it like that. I am grateful for those experiences but I think I am ready for the small experiences that will mean a lot. Chris comforted her daughter, I just want you to be happy and joyful and I don't think I've seen that in a really long time, the momager added. It breaks my heart because I just want them to be happy. I want her to be joyful and have the best relationship that she can possibly have. She has four beautiful kids so I just want them to be happy.
I am numb, I am tired of that. But I do know that I will be happy, Kim hoped. I didn't come this far just to come this far and not be happy. Remember that. Chris applauded Kim's strength, you a very strong girl and you seem to handle everything really calmly. Calmness is my superpower, Kim joked. Kim later filed for divorce from Kanye in February 2021 after six years of marriage. Watch the gut-wrenching clip above to see the iconic family's time capsule memories and be sure to tune in for the shocking two-part reunion hosted by Andy Cohen, starting next week.